All right. So, so yeah, ultimately the fox was just a part of his dream. So it was, so his memories were mixed in there. His brain working out, you know, his feelings. Oh, there's six months later. Holy cow. What have we here? I was not expecting this. Um, I can't move. Oh, oh, oh. It's moving for me. What? I get to use the mouse to look around and everything. It's all first person. Holy cow. The sensitivity is a little much. I'll try to be slow, guys. So this is a little cabin. I can zoom in. Ooh, ooh, sorry. Oh, shit! She's right there. Okay. What do we have here? I can't read it. It's too dark. The... I can't read it. Arch villains? A religion and mythology? Does it say arch villains? Holy Bible? All right. Too much religious stuff for me. They moved into this tiny little dinky place. There's a, a white lion. United States Department of Defense Certificate of Appreciation. Department of the Army. I'm guessing those are his dad's. Alright, so I can touch that. There is nothing else in here I can interact with. I can't close the door. Okay. I was totally not expecting this, guys. Not at all. Wow, this is larger than I thought it would be. Alright, I gotta... I gotta... Can I change the... Only invert. Can't change the sensitivity. Alright. I, I know it can make people sick if you look around too quickly. I don't like to have high sensitivity while on YouTube. Alright. Look around before we go in there. Can I open up outside? I can. All right. Well, we're not going yet. Lots of boxes of memories. There's his boat. There's the knife. Can I can I turn on the light, please? It's a little dark in here. Sorry guys, if this is too much for YouTube. Can't turn on the light. Oh boy. Well then. These are the paintings that we saw in there. This looks a lot like the area that we were in. Um, the, the night area, remember? Before... What was it? Fall? Or right after fall? More boxes. It's too dark for me to see what's on them. That one says Arcit Prince. Alright. Here's the washing machine that we saw out there. Can't open any of these doors. Can't open the fridge. <laughs> bricks, puffies. This um this reminds me a lot of um a cabin. When I grew up, my my uncle owned a cabin um way out in the middle of nowhere. Way out in the middle of nowhere. And um in the family, all the extended family would, would, would go out there and visit every now and again and it was pretty much like this, right? Where you where you have, you know, the washer and dryer like right in the kitchen and it's basically this. Looks like there's a guest house or something out there. I don't know. Tape player. Living room. There's the fireplace we saw out there. There's his photo when he was in the military. Yeah, all the props that we saw out there are, are pretty much in here. We saw that as well. So he was dreaming of... It was a mixture of, of this, this fox and her journey... Uh, which is probably a representation of him and and 
the cabin that he dreaded going to. Because this was his father's place. Right? That was everything, right? I didn't I didn't skip anything. Yeah, yeah. Alright, let's go out here. Can't close the door. Can't go over there. Wow, that's pretty. That's very well done. I truck moving you coast to coast at a value deal. Um, well, let us explore. No, that was creepy. There's the truck. Remember at the very beginning of the game? I gotta sneeze. Holy cow. How much more do I have to explore? I have no idea. Oh, I am capable of running into invisible walls. All right, that's unfortunate. That looks like Roblox, so I don't know. What's that? Hmm. Ooh, I can jump. He did a very good job in that skybox. That is gorgeous. The stars are twinkling. I don't know if you guys can tell. Might not be able to on YouTube. And considering, you know, some of the distant mountains during the day, they looked kind of off. These look fantastic. With the sunrise, I assume. And most of it's still at night. That looks gorgeous. That is very well done. I like it. There's the swing. Okay. We're going to leave our, our girl there. And move forward, I suppose. Whatever that is in the road. I don't have feet. That's something I'm going to have to work on getting over. And that's the fence. Can I... Whoa. Wow! That looks great! Am I... am I... wait a minute, what is the end of the game? I thought that this would take me to the end. What a place to have a, a cabin, right? Holy cow. Um, yeah, I thought... I thought that would take me to the end. I don't know. Is it... Uh, uh, invisible ball? No. Well, then we got, we got a little bit of black over there. What's up with that? It's very pretty. The sky can look so much different when there is no light pollution, huh? Um, I, I've not seen the sky in forever without light pollution. Like, forever. Alright, I think I gotta go this way. This looks like the way, right? There's lots of space over here. Gotta be the way. Um, there. Did you see that that house down there? That's a house we saw earlier in the game. Lots of things we saw earlier in the game. There's a tent. Can't go inside. But yeah, there's the tent. Can I go this way? Probably not. Yeah, that's blocked off. Visible wall. 
But it looks like I could probably go this way. that? I heard a branch break. Oh my god, it's gonna be the ghost of my father. Alright, so we got a couple pallets in here. Cigarettes. Storm drain. Hardy... Wait, hold on. Hardy Emmys leaves 1.5 million to lover. Confessions of a prime subject. That's an invisible wall. As is that. Alright. I guess I'm not meant to go this way. I wonder why... Why we got this hard line right here. Like, you didn't get the skybox to go all the way down behind the mountains. Surely, you know, someone would explore over there. Because we saw it in, like, four different locations, right? There's a fence here. Can I get around it? Can I jump over it? Oh, no, it's... Wait, what? There we go. See, I'd rather have a fence like that than an invisible wall. So... Wait. What do I do? Oh! Notice how it went white when I looked in there? Alright, so... I get to sleep in my tent to remember my father. I heard a footstep. What the hell? Interesting. Hmm. So I'm following this guy. Who I earlier thought was death, but I don't know.
This place can be a shelter if you let it. The three cubs. So, the music was phenomenal, wasn't it? It was very good. So the dev did the, the narration himself. I, I enjoyed the narration. It, I had some problems with it. I thought that when it was just the narration, when it felt like he was just talking to me, I thought it was, it was great. When they... When they started dialogue, it didn't feel like dialogue. It, it felt like narration handing back and forth, and it just didn't feel natural to me. But when they were just talking on their own, narrating to me, I thought it was great. It was it was a very beautiful game. The story was... Oh, I got an achievement. Hell yeah. Would you like to submit your statement to the first tree... To an online moderated database. It may appear randomly to other players. Um, is it going to attribute it? I wonder what name they're going to use. My Steam name? Sure, why not? Loading. And we're back. Alright, so... The game was, was beautiful. Um, uh, the aesthetics and, and the story was beautiful as well. Um, I guess let's start with the, the aesthetics. Um... The, I guess the second was was spring. The second area was spring. Third is summer. Then we had, I think, the midnight area, the night area, and then fall. Or was it the fall and the midnight area? I don't remember. Blah. The, the the beginning area was the weakest, I thought. And and that's unfortunate because you don't want your weakest area to be the, st the starting area of the game, right? But I, I think um, as, as far as visually appealing, it was, it was the least uh, effective. Um, I guess the snow just didn't... Under the snow and the trees, I don't know. And I'm not saying that because I, I don't like winter scenery. I actually absolutely love winter scenery. I love winter and autumn. And I don't know, the winter area just wasn't his strongest. I thought the summer and the fall were absolutely his strongest. And, and spring was nice too, but summer and fall were were gorgeous. Very well done. Uh, but I understand you. It, it kind of needed to be told in that order, right? Because, you know, you talked about camping once we got into summer and stuff like that. So I'm not sure how how that could have been rearranged to have the stronger area at the beginning. So, who knows? I'm not a dev. Uh, the story was, was well done. It's it's easy to connect to that story for a lot of people, I think. Um, a lot of people have grown up with, with similar situations and problems connecting with one of the parents. It didn't necessarily have to be the father, right? Um, so, I think, I think it's an easy story to relate to for a lot of people. Despite whether you had a good relationship with your parents or not, right? Even if you had a good relationship with your parents, something like that could always happen, I would think, right? So I don't, I don't, I think anybody with any kind of upbringing could could run into something like that and can absolutely relate. Um, yeah, I liked it. Well, I guess that's the end of the series. Then uh, let me know in the comments below what you guys thought of the ending. Um, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next series. Bye bye.